politics, entertainment stories, current affairs, and exclusive interviews. Welcome. Welcome. Welcome on The Buzz UG with, with Melanz Mino, Mino, a.k.a. Fuller. Now, top Ugandan artist Nis Henry risks being arrested for insinuating that President Museveni and other presidential aspirants are buttocks. In a statement posted on his socials, Nis Henry indicated that Ugandans are tired of seeing many buttocks, President Museveni's buttocks inclusive, wanting to sit on one chair. He suggested that in the next presidential elections, we should have two people, that is Jeno Muhozi Kainerugaba and His Excellency Bobby Wine, so that will be Hania Singa Mune. However, some Ugandans have said Nis Henry risks being arrested for insinuating that President Museveni and other presidential aspirants we have had before and those to come are buttocks. Well, I don't know what you think about this story, but in case you have anything on your mind, just put it down in the comment section. Now, police in Bukedia district has arrested Mr. Gerald Ampulide, the director of studies at Malera Kabara Seed Senior Secondary School, for stealing 14 computers in the same school he teaches. Uh, this guy is behind bars right now, and according to police, investigations into this matter have already commenced. Actually, this guy teaches Christian religious education at this particular school, so you can imagine the embarrassment that is right there. Okuswala. <laughs> Now, yesterday, a UPDF officer in Makindye shot dead two people and two others have been rushed to hospital in critical condition. Police says the UPDF officer is currently on the run. However, the gun has been retrieved. Now, finally, yesterday in Parliament, Honorable Solomon Serwani questioned the Speaker why the recently sessioned Minister of Lands, Housing and Urban Development, Honorable Pasi Sinamuganza, sat on the front seat of ministers and yet he has already been sessioned by Parliament, just waiting President Museveni to officially validate the session. But guess what? The Speaker of Parliament, Anita Monk, just passed the concern to another item on the order paper. Right, Honorable Speaker, this afternoon, the Honorable Passes Namuganza, who was on the 23rd of this year, January, unanimously censored by this Parliament by a very heavy vote because of misbehavior, Right, Honorable Speaker, and all the issues that is members of Parliament. So she was indicted by this Parliament. I'm surprised that this afternoon, she has majestically walked in the same parliament and sat on the front bench where the honorable ministers are supposed to be sitting. Right, honorable speaker, would we be proceeding well when somebody that this parliament has indicted, we censored her and even sent the notice to his excellency, the president, as per our rules of procedure, to come majestically and walk like a minister and sit like a minister and remain in the front with all the comfort in this repute, in this regard of the rule of this parliament, and with the moving like a minister, actually, I, I, for lack of words, right, Honorable Speaker, is that proceeding? <laughs> Are we proceeding well, right, Honorable Speaker? Honorable Member, I've got your concern, item three. Item, item three. three. Well, there you go. Those are some of the biggest stories making headlines in the news today. And in case you, you have anything on your mind, you want to sub about these stories, just put it down in the comment section. But most importantly, subscribe in case you haven't. And also tap on the bell for all the notifications. My name is Melad Zmilo, a.k.a. Fuller, and it's a bye for now. Audio Jungle.